If that was it, be a fucking genius. Honeybone Factory Morning Radio. Oh, it was one two three three two one four 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 five six four. We were pretty close. Let's work hard while keeping rules in mind. All right, so we have to be quick and find out which guard is lazy. And then we have to find the hiding spot for that area. So we really only know where the first hiding spot is. I'm sure the other ones won't be too hard to find, but I don't know. The time limit was kind of tight. It felt like we uh, just had enough time to talk to everyone and then it was time to go. I think there were even some spots where we didn't, didn't get a chance to talk to everyone. But yeah, once night falls, we're going to have to keep her moving. So this might be a segment that we need to do a couple times. We'll see. We going to the same spot we were? 790. I thought we were at like 728 or something. 794. Maybe we're actually going to end up in a different, in a different spot. Let's see. No, this is the same. I'm pretty sure. Oh shit. I forgot our little routine. X triangle circle X, I think. I literally forgot about this. <laughs> the usual morning exercise. I think we got it. Oh yeah, we're a fucking pro. I don't know if this does anything for us. Doing it a second time. We avoid the embarrassment of not fucking up. Manager did the funny bone exercise perfectly. Oh yeah, we get a sweet potato. I think it's just a cold one as well. So it's really not anything too crazy. Safety first. Feel free to look around, manager. You look like a little monkey boy. Frog. Oh yeah, we have the wine coupon. I forgot about that. Um, I'll have to go to the bar at night. Damn, I was just saying how our inventory really hasn't gotten too full. Free Nan. How you doing, girl? All right, give me some info. I'm in play number 795. All right. You can climb up the ladder of success. Oh no, you need another nap, Brianna. His job is to mix the concrete. Guys are really not providing much in terms of useful info. Building a new factory, and then new employees will work here. Please get out of my fucking way. Okay. You're just a manager for a day, so you can't be promoted. I, on the other hand, will. 
little does he know we're about to pull off the greatest heist of all time. Yep, we know about the ten ranks. But we're just gonna skip. So this must not be the right area. I was hoping it would show up right away. I'm a good manager. I pay attention. Yeah, it must be on the next part of the... I wish we could kiss him. Unless this guy says that the guard is lazy. I'm the manager of the leveling work. You can count on me. What we're looking for is a guard that is lazy so that we can hide in the factory after hours. It doesn't look like he's in this section though. There are people we can kiss here at night though. Once we do get to stay in. About time. We'll view an operating factory. Right, let's see what this guy at the conveyor has to say. This section takes care of rejected parts from the next section. We make new parts from any rejects. I just wish payday would come soon. I'm assuming all the guards, even the lazy ones, probably still say you can count on me. Guests are no exception. Yeah, there's a hole up there. Hole right here. So this is another one we know where the hiding spot is. Oh my god, you motherfucker. Knocking me over. Special vacation will be awarded to a hard worker. So I work each day and don't take time off. I can't wait. Not too many people to talk to. Unless we can go inside. Oh, I don't think we ever went inside here before. He's employee number 9,976. I'm still a subordinate. Huh. To be honest, I don't like this work environment. Keep, if I keep working like I do now, I'll get a promotion. I look forward to life and my bright future. When I drink funny cola, I can't help thinking about work. I wonder why. Either way, my goal is to get promoted, so I guess it's okay. Uh-oh, we're gonna get kicked out before we can talk to everyone. Funny Cola is the soft drink of Funny Bone Bottlers. I've been drinking it since I was a student. I drink one every day in the afternoon. I'm new, sir. Nice to meet you, sir. I heard that we don't have a company president. I'm worried knowing that I'm working for a company without it. Fuck, there's two people we didn't get to talk to. Ugh. I really hope it wasn't this area. What if we get to the end and we just don't find anyone who talks about the guards? That would be sad. Unit Chief. What's so good about being promoted? I wonder if I should quit. I feel empty. Ha! Huh. I drifted off again. I need to get back to work, otherwise they'll think I'm lazy. Well, there's the guard. If worse comes to worse, we can talk to the guard. Yes, you could live a life like that, but I can't believe he gave up his position. 
God, stop knocking me down, you fucks. That's what happened last time. I wonder if that guy's scripted to just climb in. 564. Last part of the code. Right. I really talk to everybody here already. Dude, fucking hell, stop knocking me down. <laughs> Ugh. Not very many people to talk to in this part. Yeah, I think they all say this. Well, I think we're fucked, guys. I think this is the last the last work site. This one's got a lot of people spread out too, I think. Yes, I'm retiring soon. So that's presumably the hiding spot. Hmm. I'm not miserable. I'm just kind of lost. 829. Build and destroy. Destroy and build again. I'm not miserable. Just kind of lost. Doesn't appear that we can talk to that guy. Um, I think we just hide in here. We really... We really didn't... See anyone talk about any of the guards. What does this say here? You need to speak to all the workers. One in the four areas of the factory tells you which guard is lazy. We got fucked. Once you arrive in first area speak with all the workers if one worker tells you that the lazy guard is in that area you need to hide in that area if none of the workers mention a lazy guard go to the next once you've successfully eluded the guard board the train Alright, I guess we'll uh, reload. What's the easiest way to, I guess, reset the game? We could have done that even before we got off the train. Alright, I guess we'll give it a go once more. I wonder if it's seated at the beginning of the day. And we could just brute force it. I don't think it's the first area. Just because we were pretty thorough. I'm thinking it was the second area because there were two guys we didn't talk to. And that one was really far out of the way. Saucy. How are you doing, sir? Studio punchline. All right, loading in. If we can get into this safe, we'll be done with this area for the most part. Oh, we're a lady killer. I didn't even realize we're a lady killer now. We were a handsome boy.
Just all right. What the heck? Why are you just all right? All right. We're going on the tour. Let's go. We're going to do the exercise again. God, this is a really tedious part if we can't nail it down. I'm wondering if it's a new person that will spawn or if like an existing person gets additional dialogue. Because if there's a new guy that's just there and wasn't there before, that would make this a lot more obvious. Hi, Bree. I think she stepped away from the computer. She'll see you when, when she gets back, though. Unstep. Quite. Quite a way to do it. The unstep, my favorite. Seven ninety four. Just goes sequentially from there. 795, 796. So if we probably should try and get those those guys. Oh Riker. You make me so happy. As soon as we're done with the uh little manager dance here. The morning exercise. We just got him a whole bunch of new treats, too. X triangle. Circle. X. Beautiful. Manager did the funny bone exercise perfectly. The sweet potato is for you. Throw away. La lavender. Alright. Please feel free to look around. Hold on, I just want to see really quick if there's anyone new. I'm gonna assume we'll talk to everyone, but let me get this. Let me get this boy. Reeton. Blow this bad boy up. There we go. I'll be right back.
He was uh, giving the love to the camera. He literally stared right into it. <laughs> it was nice. Thank you, Mr. Saucy177. I thank you, and Joel thanks you especially. Alrighty. Let's talk to these fucking people. It was goo. All right, please, someone say something about the guard being lazy. The guy won't talk to us. We're building a new factory. I'm thinking it might be determined at the beginning of the day. But I just wanted to be sure. Talk me, you fuck. Mix the concrete right. We'll go immediately into the building in the next area and uh, talk to the people in there. We got a bastard. So I think it's at 11 a.m. Maybe we'll get kicked out like in five minutes here. The subordinate class. An official work title. Oh, maybe we have a little bit more time than I'm thinking. Yep, we might have until noon. I guess we'll talk to everybody. But I don't think we're gonna find any new info. The manager of the leveling work. The only guy we didn't talk to is this uh, concrete guy. Too late. Maybe we get an hour and a half in each area because it was 11.30 when they kicked us out. Alright, we're going to immediately go in here. There were two guys we didn't get to talk to and I've got a sneaking suspicion. This is like the most out of way out of the way guy in the entire factory, so I heard that drinking funny cola daily is good for you. I feel like I can work forever after I drink it. Hold on. Worker evaluations. We might have to just brute force it if nobody says anything. Everyone here is a new subordinate, but I'll be promoted before the others. I was the top of the, of the class in my school. I'll be here too. Bro, what? No one's saying anything about the about the guard. We're just gonna guess. I drink one every day in the afternoon. 
I'm new, sir. Nice to meet you, sir. I heard that we don't have a company president. Yes, this is all very familiar. You talk about this guy? Hmm. <laughs> all right, I think we're going to brute force. Manager of the day is Joel. Goodbye. The BB boy. He do be a BB. All right, fuck it. We're going to hide. If this doesn't work, then we have to do all of that all over again. I don't know. No one, no one mentioned any of the guards being lazy. So we're just going to guess. Probably going to get fucking killed here. He's checking. There's no way he finds us here, right? Impossible. No. Caught you. I know you're hiding there. Come out. And we're dead. Oh, he didn't actually kill us. He just broke our neck and threw us into the train and kicked us out. What the fuck? I'm assuming they're just going to toss me on the conveyor belt. Kind of interested here. Let me see what, like, a different tulip guide says. I'm, there's got to be more than one, right? Tulip? Walk through. Well, that was a fucking bust. We have to go through all that all over again. All right, let's just see. <laughs> it just says, talk to the employees to find the lazy security guard. Okay, so this tells me specifically which employee in which area will tell me. The northwest corner near the cement bags. Inside the factory building, second floor. The wrecking ball operator. You need to go right away to the wrecking ball and wait until he dismounts. It was probably the wrecking ball then. Because that was the one guy we didn't get a chance to talk to. Of course it was. <laughs> Alright. It's probably the wrecking ball. We'll check each guy just to be, to be certain, but... This is way more helpful than that other guide, I gotta say. All right, third time's the charm. Be friendly, be healthy. Keep the rules in mind. All right, let's go. And Aoko. Let's get a move on. 
Watch us get fucking murdered. We accidentally waste too much time in the factory or something and get murdered at night. And we have to do all of this again. Let's see what else. Any other tips? Program the factory train to reach the safe. All right, we are only going to talk to the important people. But I'm assuming it's just me the third, the third stop. We're gonna have to go through the exercise again. God, man, there's a lot. This is a very punishing spot to to die in. <laughs> 